Let me tell y'all a story that this happened recently on how I got scammed on Snapchat. Let me tell y'all a story on how I got scammed on Snap. I got scammed. So, you know, even though I made that video titled, uh, why I, 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 I it's called why women piss me off or something. Well, I actually kind of went against my own ideologies and I started adding a whole bunch of girls on Snapchat. And then this one girl posted something. She was like, Hey, uh, Hey, uh, uh, you know, she was at, pretty much, she had like a, like an advertisement, like, Hey, this is how much you got to pay if you want nudes or a FaceTime video, like a FaceTime, FaceTime or a meetup or a meetup is pretty much you, you meet and fucker, all of that shit. So before, before I get into the story, see, I used to say, I'm never paying for pussy. I'm never paying for pussy. But when you think about it, when you interact with most women, you're, you're already paying for pussy by taking her out, you know, your gas money, going to get her, the food, the activities. You're already paying for the pussy any fucking ways. You're already paying for it. And I heard dudes say that in the past, but I didn't believe it because I watched a video by Tyrone Magnus and he said, that's not true. You're not paying for pussy. Yes, you are. You're taking a girl out, wasting your gas, wait, spending money on food. You're paying for activities. You're already paying for pussy. So I said, you know what? I guess I'll be down paying for pussy. But it's crazy because uh, cause like there's these two girls. And I don't even fuck. But... Cause there's these two girls that was trying to have me pay for it, and I told them no, but like a couple months after that, I was like, oh yeah, you know, I actually would have paid for that shit, but uh, <laughs> you know, but then eventually I was like, now nah, I was like, you know what, I don't want to pay for pussy no more, and then now I was like, oh yeah, I'll pay for it now. So, so she said, she said, twenty percent off. For a meetup. I said, okay. I swiped up. I said, yo, uh, what you look like? She showed me what she looked like. She was just a she was just a uh regular looking white girl, nothing too special. Regular looking, you know. She was alright. She was about a six point five, six point she was all right, six point seven. She wasn't that bad. But you know, you know, probably the lowest I could smash is a six. So she wasn't I'm like, alright, cool. I was like, yo, I was like, yo, uh, how much you charging for a meetup? She said, uh, uh, she said, I think she said, uh, $75 if, if, if you're down to come my way and 125 if I have to come your way. I said, uh, but, but yeah, but I think before that she asked me, she asked me, no, uh, I asked her where she lived and she said she stays in Champaign. She said she stays in Urbana. Was was that's like an hour and a half away from me. I said, okay, well, how much are you gonna charge to come to me? She said, okay, about one twenty five. All right, cool. I said, okay. Um, I said, <laughs> I said, um, what I said? I was like, so, uh, what are you into? She said, anal. I'm like, shit, that's what I like too, nigga. What the fuck is that shit? She said, yeah. Uh, I was like, bet. I was like, uh. I said, okay. Um, well, yeah, okay. Send me your, she sent me her cash app, sent the 125. Uh, she said, okay, uh, I'll be on the way. Just give me a second. I got to take a shower. All right, cool. So this, uh, around this time, I think it's like 6 o'clock, 5 o'clock or something. So, okay, cool. She's probably going to be here maybe around 8, 8 o'clock. All right, cool. And yesterday was my day off. I said, okay, cool. I'm about to fuck this bitch. Get my rocks off and, and go back to live my life. So... I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. I'm uh, getting the house cleaned up, putting on my scent, putting on my uh, wax melts, my fucking wax melts, putting on incense, took me a shower. I don't got a haircut, but I'm still clean, motherfucker. Took me a fucking shower, getting ready. You know what I'm saying? Just waiting for this bitch so she can get piped up and then send her ass on her fucking way. She sent me a message like, oh my God, uh, 
you know, I got into a fucking car accident. Uh, my, <laughs> my fu- I got into, I almost got into a fucking car accident. My fucking tires popped. Like, yo, I need some fucking help, bro. You got to fucking send me $119 to fix my goddamn tire, man. You got to send me $119 to fix my motherfucking tire, man. My tire popped, man. You know, you know, I'm fucking on my way to give you some pussy, man, but my fucking tire popped, man. You got to give me some money so I can get back on the highway. Fuck you, man. I'm like, what the fuck? I said, how the fuck your tire pop, bro? She's like, yeah, you know, da da da, this happened, yo, da da da, and it, it just didn't, it just didn't seem right. I'm like, so randomly, you fucking tired, just randomly, your tire pops, just randomly, your tire just pops, this like now all out of all days, now your tire pop. It, was, it looked a little suspicious, but she was texting me like she was being dead ass, like yo, my fucking tire pop, dog, like. Bro, like, I almost died because, like, uh, because, like, I had put the, uh, the skull emoji, which means dead. She was like, what's so funny? Like, I could have almost died. Like, what you laughing at? What's so funny? Uh, what the hell's wrong with you? She made it sound, she made it seem convincing as fuck. She made it seem convincing as fuck that she was about to, <laughs> she made it seem convincing as, convincing as fuck. Like, she was really in a sticky situation. And she was all by, because, like, she was all by herself. It was at nighttime. I'm like, okay, well, you know, I, I ain't just finna just leave her out there. She's a girl, all by, she don't got no money, you know. I ain't just finna leave her out there, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm like, all right. So, I was like, she said, hey, well, you know, if you can't pay the 119 just send me 90 bucks, and I'll be on the way to come see you, and da 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 I said, okay. <laughs> Uh, so I sent the fucking ninety dollars, man. But it, but at this time, like it was so fucking late, bro. But it, but during the mix of this, there was a girl who added me on Snap. She had added me on Snap by search, and she said, "Hey," I said, "Hey," and she says, "Uh, where are you from?" I said, "This place." She said, like, and I said, "What's up?" She was like, "Oh," she was like, "Uh, are you?" She's like, she was like, do, she's like, "Do you pay for meetups?" I said, "Sure." Cause other girl like, she, like with her, I just kind of, I just kind of like, just kind of, lo- I, I was too tired. I said fuck it, whatever. I told her just to go on home. I say, hey man, you know, just, just go on home. Just, you know, just, just get home safe. She said okay. She, she like, are you sure? Are you sure you don't want me to come? I'm like, nah, just go home, man. It's all good. You know, we, can, we can reschedule another time. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So this other girl that hit me up, she was bad as fuck. She's like a little light skinned chick, mixed long hair. What I'm, you know. Um, she was like, do you pay for meetups? I said, yeah. And I was, she was, I was like, how much you charge? She said, uh, about a hundred, about a hundred. I said, okay. Uh, okay. Send, send it to her on cash app. I was like, yo, I was like, uh, could you come to me? Cause I don't have a car. She said, yeah, sure. She's like, yo, can you send me 40 for gas? Okay, sure. Here you go. Send her the fucking 40. So I'm waiting for this fucking bitch. I'm waiting for this bitch. She says the same shit. Oh, hey, my fucking, my fucking, uh, uh, I think my, 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 my car ran out of oil. My car ran out of oil. Uh, yo, can you send me like $38 so I can get, so I can put some oil in my car? My car ran out of oil. I'm like, how the fuck does both of y'all fucking cars fucking up in the same goddamn night? How the fuck both of y'all cars fucking up, man? How the fuck is both of y'all cars fucking up? In the same night. Like, okay, you know, there's been times where my car fucked up just randomly. Things happen. But how the fuck does it both happen to both of y'all in the same goddamn night? It just started looking fucking suspicious. I said, wait a sec. Wait, 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 wait. So, I'm like, wait. I'm like, well, I'm like, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was on a, I was on a process of situation. And I said, because... That same girl, so so the girl, the light skinned chick, she had posted on her story, and she had the same motherfucking, the same shit that said, uh, this like it was the same exact post of the other girl where it said, oh, twenty percent off for meetups, this for Facetime, this for Facetime, this for nudes, this for that. It was it was the same exact fucking post on the Snapchat. I said, hey, I was like. 
are you friends with this girl? She's like, who? I said, da da da. She was like, no, I don't know her. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm like, y'all both got the same goddamn shit. And y'all both, go, and y'all, and both of y'all motherfucking car randomly just broke down in the same goddamn night. Both of y'all fucking car broke down the same night. This, this looks a little fishy. Yeah, both of y'all got the same fucking post on your Snapchat. And both of y'all car broke down the same fuck. I'm like, this look a little fishy. I was like, okay, well, you, oh, I said, okay. I said, show me, I said, show me proof that your car is actually, show me proof that you're on the fucking highway driving and show me proof that your motherfucking car is fucked up. You know, if that's true, I, I'll send it. No, no, no. Before that, I said, I said, before that, I said, I said, how about you use the money that I gave you to fucking pay for the oil? Why don't you use that, that, that the fucking 140 that I sent you? She said, oh, uh, I already spent that already. How the fuck you already spent it? So you just spent all of that quick? I said, show me proof you're on the highway, and then I'll motherfucking send you the money. She said, uh, okay, and she took a fucking snap. It didn't even show shit. All she did was just p take a picture of the dashboard. I'm like, no, I said, bitch, show me the picture of the fucking highway. The fuck, like, the fuck, like, I'm like, okay, this looks a little fishy. Looks a little fucking fishy. Looks a little fi But this girl, I had told her, like, hey, you know, maybe let's let's fuck another time because it's, it's late. It's like 3 o'clock in the fucking morning. I'm about to go to sleep. I ain't, I ain't, you know, it's late. She's like, oh, no, uh, I want to fuck tonight, though. Let's do it tonight. I said, okay, well, come on. But then that, that fucking shit happened. I'm like, what the fuck going on, man? So, so, I'm like, okay. So that bitch didn't come because her car was... Some a car fucked up on the highway. It's like the last girl. I'm like, okay, whatever. So, but the but the other girl, the first girl, the little white girl. I said, hey, listen. I said, uh, I said, okay. I said, <laughs> so it was the it was today. I was like, yo, you, you know. So, uh, so the last girl, uh, I forgot to mention. I was like, yo, what are you into? She said butt stuff. I'm like, I'm like, damn. Both of these girls like anal. That's good. I'm like, that's great. And then she sent me, and then I was like, yo, send me a picture. She sent me a picture. I'm like, oh, and you know it, it uh her you know it she she looks nice but um the the next girl she was like uh she told me she's like hey uh i can come over today if you're available i said yeah i'm available she said oh okay she's like hey can you uh send me <laughs> she's like hey can you send me uh 30 dollars for gas and i was just questioning the both how the fuck of them i said both of y'all got the same post on your page both of y'all talk both of y'all when they was texting me, they both sounded the they both sounded similar with how they was talking to me. I'm like y'all both text the same, you know y'all y'all car both break down at the same time. You know both of y'all car break down at the same time. Uh, what else? Y'all both had the same post on your motherfucking snap. It's like it's like I'm putting two and two together. Like I'm putting two and two together. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, uh, I had typed in that girl's name on Instagram because, you know, hoping that her Snapchat name is the same as her Instagram name. It, and it was, nigga, the same fucking girl, the white girl, that they both denied, oh, I don't know her, I don't know her. That And that's crazy because I told him, I was like, yo, I was like, uh, I was like, I, uh, 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 earlier, I was like, yo, I was like, I was like, are you sure that you guys are coming? They, both of them said, on, on my dead grandpa, I'm coming. On my dead grandpa. And I believe them, but 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 I'm like, no. The first girl said it, I believe her. But then the second girl said, I'm like, so both of y'all got dead grandpas? I'm like, both of y'all got dead grandpas? I mean, it's possible to have, you know, grandpas are old. You know, they're old, so it's possible that both of y'all have two dead grandpas. But y'all both said on your dead grandpa. I'm like, okay, this is some fucking, okay, y'all niggas, is this, so anyways, I went to the girl fucking Facebook, and that same white ass girl was on that fucking girl's fucking shit, man. I'm like, y'all fucking lying. And I said, bro, y'all some scammers, bro. And I was like, hey, I ain't even mad at you, because I understand that, you know, motherfuckers gotta survive out here. I get it. You know, I'm, I wasn't even pissed off. But, just fucking admit it. That's all I was trying to do is just, just have them admit it. Just come clean and say, yes, I'm a scammer. Yeah, you you've been scammed. Just say they kill. Oh, I'm not a scammer. Oh, no, 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 I'm not a scammer. I'm not a scammer. And then the last bitch fucking 
the light skinned girl deactivated her snap her snap her snapchat i'm like bitch you gonna deactivate <laughs> you gonna deactivate your snap <laughs> and then this fucking the, then the white bitch i'm like so she said she's supposed to come here at eight o'clock i said yo if you're not here by eight o'clock i'm blocking you so right now it's like 7 46 if she's not here at eight o'clock which i most which i highly doubt she's gonna show up i said she's getting blocked so long story short, I'm letting you guys know about Snapchat scammers, and I'm letting you guys know not to think with your dick. See, because I was fucking, you know, like I was fucking feeling kind of like confused at life because I'm like, damn, you know, like what the fuck can I do to get successful? Because I know that God ain't going to do shit. I know that the law of attraction is bullshit, so I can't manifest shit. It's like I have to actually, like, get successful on my own. Like, no one's going to fucking help me get successful. It's like I have to I have to do this shit all by myself. So I was kind of stressed out, and I said, hey, you know, something that will calm me down is some fucking pussy, right? Some fucking anal sex, some butthole, right? I'm like, well, shit, let me, so you know what I'm saying? But then this is a fucking scam. And shit, who knows the girls in the past who told me to do a meetup? That, that could have been a scam, too. So, I'm letting you guys know about these Snapchat scams where a girl says, "Hey, this this I, I charge I charge this much for a meetup," and then she'll say she's on the way. And then you pay her, say she's on the way. Then she said, "Oh, my car broke down. Can you send some extra money?" And then you send her the money, and then it's, then she might say something else. And then, oh, oh, I, oh, I forgot. They also said so. The, the white girl said, "Hey, can you send 15 bucks for food?" Oh my, I'm like, I'm like bitch. Use the money that I paid you for fucking food. Like, come the fuck on, man. Y'all motherfuckers tripping, man. Like, come the fuck on, man. Scam my fucking thirty. And I think I probably came out of pocket like two seventy, like two seventy, maybe three hundred dollars over some pussy, man. My fucking bitch, my fucking bitch ass, man. My fucking clown ass, man. You know, cause a man's weakness is women. Every man's or most men's weakness is women. That's most, look at Samson in the Bible, remember Samson in the Bible, nigga with the dreads, he let fucking, uh, Delilah, uh, the whole time Delilah was working with the enemy, and she got him drunk, fucked him, and he was just chilling, you know, this, you know, she, he was, uh, he, he was asleep, drunk as fuck, and then she set him up, called the enemies over there, and, and, and the enemies fucked him up, because she set his ass up. See, women is a man's weakness. You have to over you have to overcome your your weakness for women. This is a life lesson. I'm not even I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad, bro. This is a life lesson. Control your fucking dick. Quit letting your fucking cock. Quit letting your fucking cock overshadow your your, your fucking sense of judgment. I mean, I thought it was just I mean, I thought it was going to work out. I'm like, I'll pay her 125 and then she come on the way. <laughs> I ain't paying for no pussy again, bro. I'm being dead ass. I'm I'm not doing this shit again. This is the last girl. Nah, this, <laughs> I was finna pay for some put. I'm not doing this shit again, man. This is it. This is I, I'm never I'm for I'm being dead ass for the rest of my life. I'm never paying for pussy ever again. You know. You know, and shit. I, I'm I'm contemplating on even trying to take out take because like I said like. You know, you're 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 already paying for pussy by taking a girl out, but doing this, doing that, doing that. I ain't doing bro, I'm thinking about not doing that shit either. If if we go on a date, bitch, we going to fucking Starbucks. I'm gonna buy you a cup of coffee and a fucking croissant for seven bucks. And we and we finna take a walk through the park. I'm not whining and dining man, fuck that. I am no yeah, yes yeah, fuck that. I'm not whining and dining no bitches. We ain't going to no fucking restaurant, bitch. And if we are, you paying. And, I, and, I, and I'm gonna, and I'm letting that shit be known up front. Yeah, you're paying for your fucking meal. But you know, I guess I wouldn't mind paying for a little coffee and a croissant at start seven bucks. That's all right. Other than that, bitch, you paying for your own shit. I'm tired of this shit. Nah, I'm I'm done paying for bitches, bro. I'm not paying for bitches no more, man. I'm trying to get my fucking dick wet and got fucking played like a motherfucker. My fucking dick got got in the fucking way of my fucking moral judgment. 
These hoes finesse my fucking punk ass. They finesse my bitch fucking ass, man. They finesse my fucking punk ass, dog. They finesse my bitch ass, dog. God damn. Both of y'all was both of y'all was in cahoots with each other. And this is another thing. Pretty pr a lot of pretty girls are fucking gold diggers. A lot of pretty girls are gold diggers. I'm being dead ass. If you if if a chick's hot, nigga, she she most likely a, is a fucking gold digger. She most likely only likes you for money. And th th and this is and, and, and I already said this in a previous video how women I mean men look at women as sex objects and women look at men as an ATM machine. We both don't look at each other like human beings. We look at each other for some men. Oh yeah, man, I don't care about her feelings. All I care about is her pussy, man. I don't care about who she. I care about put, bitch. I don't care about his feelings and what he going through. I care about what is money. It's the same shit, man. It's crazy how if you want a solid chick, you have to lower. You have to fucking lower your standards and get you a fucking five, a fucking one out of ten, a two, a three, a four, five, or a six. And a seven can be both. Like some girls that are seven can be gold diggers too, and the other girls that are sevens can kind of be solid. It just depends on who you who they are. Both can be on both. Sevens are like a thin line, but eights and above, all them fuck. I ain't say all because you know obviously not every single chick that's that's an eight, nine, or ten is a gold digger, but a lot of them girls, especially in America, they pretty. They they get a lot of attention from men. They get a lot, oh my God, baby, they, all that attention. So, so they're going to use that to their advantage to play your bitch ass. A lot of hot, a lot of hot bitches, they're going to use their looks to play your ass. And I, I'm not saying every single chick is like that. Just want a preference. I'm not talking about all fucking girls that's like that. And look like that. I like that. But a lot are fucking like, yes, a lot of them are like that. Yes, they all they care about is your fucking money. You ain't going to talk to them, and, and they're not going to fuck with you unless you're spending some money on them. They don't care about your time. They don't care about your love or affection. They don't care about that shit. All they care about is what's in your fucking wallet. This, and and I, I'm a fucking dumbass for going against my video where I said, this is why, where I said, why I don't talk to women or whatever or whatever, and I just fucking contradicted myself. This is why. Shit like this. But now, now I'm totally like, not talking to women no more. I'm being dead ass. Like I'm totally not doing it. Uh, unless a girl comes to me first, talks to me first, you would never catch me approaching a fucking girl, bro. Ever, ever. Only way I guess I would approach a girl is if she had all the qualities that I look for. She's she looks nice. She's intelligent. She uh she's nurturing. She, you know, every if she, if she hits all the fucking nails on the fucking ha all the nails with the hammer, I'll say, you know what, I'll approach her. But if it's just looks, and I don't really see none of the personalities that I look for, I ain't saying shit. Fuck that. Nope, I'm good. Nope. Nope, I ain't saying shit. Just like a, like a couple days back, there's a coworker of mine where I had asked her to like to uh put me on with her sister because i thought her sister was cute but fuck that i, I don't care about looks no more a lot of these women they they, they 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 look good but they ain't really about shit it's just the truth a lot of them look good but they ain't about shit they're not about shit like it's all they got all women got is just this that's all they got man that's all they got take away that they don't got shit me personally Take away my looks, I'm still funny and smart. So even if I'm ugly, I'm still funny and smart. I'm still funny and smart. Women, you take take that face away, take that pussy away. They ain't shit, man. They don't got nothing to offer your ass. That's a fucking nothing. That's a that's a waste of fucking space. This is why I don't fucking talk to women, cause shit like this, man. Entitled motherfuckers, gold digging ass motherfucker, scam my fucking punk ass. Now I gotta fucking beat my fucking cock, cause I ain't get no fucking pussy. Fuck.
And these girls were like ghetto as fuck. I ain't really into ghetto girls, but I'm like, oh, well, I already fucking paid the shit, so I'll fuck it. You know, they were, well, the white girl, she was all right looking. The, the light-skinned chick, she was she was cute. But I'm not really into, like, all that ghetto-ass shit. Because, like, they, they, they ghetto as fuck. I'm like, I'm not really into these ghetto-ass bitches, man. You know, because, like, I was on that one girl Instagram. She she taking pictures with guns and shit. And all her family and friends is fucking gangsters. I'm like, I don't know, I don't know if I want this fucking bitch around me, man. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I, don't know, I don't know if I want this bitch around me, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't fuck with that hood ass shit, man. I'm like, I don't know about this, but I'm like, I already paid the hoe. I already paid the whore. So, which I'm not, you know, in my last video where I said being a hoe isn't a bad thing. So I'm not trying to say whore as an insult. I'm just trying to be funny. But um, I already paid the whore to fucking shit. I'm like, well, fuck it. I'm, I, you know, let me go ahead and fuck this ghetto bitch real quick and never talk to her for the rest of my fucking life. But... Man, bro. Also called off of work because I had to work today. I'm like, I'm like, I'm, I'm like, I want some pussy. Today. I'm calling off work. I called off fucking work to get some of this shit. I called off of my fucking nine to five slavery to get some of this fucking shit, man. I, like I've been up all day waiting since like six a.m. It's eight o'clock. I'm still waiting, nigga. That bitch ain't coming, dog. She ain't coming. And then, you know, a lot of girls, which I, I can understand it, she she was saying, hey, uh, the white girl, hey, uh, you got you, you to gotta pay me first because there's been a couple times where I came to the person's house without paying and I did things without, you know, and the people make, made me do things without paying me first. And I don't want that to happen to me and stuff like that, you know, so I'm trying, I'm trying to make sure that I get my end of the bargain. Bro, they were so good. They were so good <coughs> at the deception. It was, it was good, man. I'll give these girls a round of applause. They, they, they did a great job. They did a great job, man. They, they did a marvelous job with the deception. It was, <laughs> it was just the only thing that they did. There were some flaws, which is like, motherfucker, y'all both saying the same shit. Y'all both had the same post on your shit. Y'all Both of y'all cars broke down. I fucking typed your name on Instagram. And y'all was in the same picture together. Nigga, y'all in cahoots. So there were some flaws and I fucking found that shit out. Because I'm a fucking smart ass motherfucker. But I'm a dumb ass motherfucker. But letting my fucking ding a ling 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 get in cloud my fucking cloud my fucking shit, man. Let my ding a ling 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 ding a ling 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 a ling ling fucking make me fuck up and be a fucking dumbass, man. Make me be a fucking punk piece of shit. Motherfucker. Shit. May be a simp ass motherfucker, man. May turn me to a simp ass motherfucking dog. Shit. Crazy, bro. A lot of times, if you want you a solid girl, you gotta date you an ugly girl. I'm telling you, a lot of them pretty ass girls, man, a lot of them act like that. It's the truth. A lot of them sexy girls, like, damn, face looking nice, body nice, ass popping. You know, you know, camel toe showing through the leggings. Oh, man. I, oh, the, like the girl that makes you drool and go, humming, 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 humming. A lot of them girls, bro, are fucking entitled. They're scammers. They're gold diggers. That's just how they are, man. I'm being dead ass. Why do you got to date an ugly ass bitch just to get what you want? Why can you not date you a little cute girl? And she's solid. Why you gotta always get you an ugly ass girl? Like there was even a dude on YouTube. There was even a dude on YouTube who said the same thing. Like, yeah, bro. Like he was like, yeah, if you want a solid girl, you gotta date you an ugly girl. Cause he said a lot of them pretty girls are entitled and they gold diggers, all this shit. That's some real shit, bro. That's some real solid shit. This is why a lot of times, like, this is why even kind of like mentally, I'll be more inclined to talk to a chick who's average or not even all that. As opposed to a fucking bad bitch. Because I know her fucking badass, sexy ass going to be on some bullshit. I know she is. It's like, man, fuck out of here, dog. <laughs> Hell no. All right, man. I'm, all right, man. This video, you know, this video's over, man. I'm ranting too much. I'm out, man. Peace out. The motherfucking bitches, they, 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 they fucking deceive me, man. They, 
they fucking lowered my guard because they used to call they, they was they was calling me baby and babe like baby babe you know baby you know all that you know, all that fucking soft talking i was like oh okay how much do you need babe? okay they they fucking they they they, they seduce my fucking ass I, I i wasn't strong enough man i bet them hoes right now you know fucking on their cash app to put that shit in their bank account they like <laughs> hold on they like they like they like this. They like this right here, dog. They like this. They like this. <laughs> we just finessed that nigga. <laughs> we about to go shopping. Get our nails done. Get our bikini wax. Get our Brazilian butt lift. Get our tits done. Get our motherfucking nails done. Our eyelashes done. Get our hair makeup done. We just finessed that nigga. <laughs> Ran off on the plug twice. <laughs>